Hi again. In tutorial 1 of our multi-camera editing project, we have already imported the footage from different cameras into the project. We have done a rough cut and we have arranged the material inside of the timeline and we also did some renaming of the track headers so that they match our camera naming. In this tutorial now we want to show you how you can do a v-sync between the different cameras, which is an essential thing to do before we can continue with the real editing of the different sources. We have imported our footage into the different camera tracks in Nero Video and we want to do hard cuts between the different tracks to create an interesting final video. To do so, we first need to match the AV sync for all of the tracks. As you can see via the audio waveforms, each track has a slightly different starting point and the sound peaks do not match. Via the waveforms, we can already do a rough positioning of the tracks by setting the cursor and dragging the clips to roughly match these peak positions. Let's see how that sounds now. Ok, already not too bad, but as expected, we are hearing quite some reverb. This is caused by the offset between the different tracks. Let's fix this. First, we are checking camera 1 audio via the audio waveform. For doing so, we need to go to the track header of camera 2 through to 4 and mute all audio of these tracks. Then, we play the start sequence of camera 1 and are putting the cursor over an audio reference point. Now we zoom in to a closer view and with the right mouse click set a marker to a frame and zoom out again. Now we will be doing the syncing between camera 1 audio and camera 2 audio. For this reason we will mute audio on camera track 1 and also mute the audio on tracks 3 and 4. On track 2 audio we can visually check the waveform for the same audio pattern that we used as a reference before. We will set another marker here and will drag camera 2 clip to the same position as camera 1 via matching the two markers. By putting the timeline cursor over the markers we will see matching frames via a small triangle snapping to the marked frames. Now we can unmute the audio for track 1 and acoustically check the audio sync between camera 1 and 2. The sound we are hearing now is free of reverb and lip synced between camera 1 and 2. For the audio tracks of camera 3 and 4 we have already repeated the shown process. This way we are ready with the AV sync for all audio tracks in our multicam project now. Let's do a final sound preview. Ok, that sounds alright. Ok, so we are ready with tutorial 2 now. And in the next tutorial we want to show you how you can match color, brightness, and also contrast for the different camera tracks. Thanks for watching and make sure to check the next part. See you!